Most pilots start their career in the infamous Falcon de Lacy Sidewinder, a classic ship design that has been used in various configurations for over 300 years. Its original design was a light support ship that lacked a jump drive. However, modern compact drives have allowed jump-capable versions to be created, making this a useful all-rounder, a jack-of-all-trades, master of none, if you will. Some navies still use the Sidewinder, affectionately termed Vasidi, as light fighters and patrol craft. Cheap and often disregarded, it is not harmless. It is among the top when it comes to maneuverability thanks to the DeLacy patented spin ionic MV drives. It can outturn most other ships, being topped in maneuverability only by the Eagle, Vulture, and Imperial Courier, and has solid lateral thrust. However, the spin ionic drive does not help with speed. The Sidewinder is one of the slowest ships in production, and its whole integrity leaves much to be desired. The Sidewinder is an acceptable ship in a fight, but lacks firepower. New pilots seeking guidance should always use the superior maneuverability to their advantage and lock the other ship in a turning battle. However, this maneuverability is not enough to make up for fighting much more powerful ships, such as the Vulture, in which the Sidewinder is only good at one thing. The Sidewinder has heat vents located on the top left and right of the ship, just behind the cockpit, that open up when the ship heats up beyond 80%. Hard points are located just in front of the cockpit, two smalls right next to each other. One of the only ships produced where you're able to see your guns actually operate. As mentioned earlier, the Sidewinder is jump capable, and with that, we will see you next week in Aravate with the Eagle.